it's Trevor Royce with Royce Ministries International coming to you from Granada, Spain. Hope you're having a good morning. Uh, we wish we could be there, but we can come to you in video, and so this is just about as good as you can get. So I want to say this morning, thank you so much for spotlighting our ministry and the work that we're doing here in Granada, Spain. Thank you for the help and the prayers and the love and the support and everything you guys have done over the few years, and uh, we just really appreciate it. Uh, everything that you do for us. And so right now this morning, I'm coming to you live from Fuego Vivo, where we worship every Sunday. And John is going to show you a little bit of the stage here at the church. you got this beautiful picture of Spain with God's hands around it. And uh, we've got a really nice place to worship here. It's a really nice house. And it, there's more than 13 different countries uh, represented here. People all over the world who live in Spain come here and call this their church home. And so when you think of us in our ministry, think of this house and uh, the great opportunity we have here to work with Wade and Maria Weaver and the ministry that they've already got in place. And that this church will continue to grow and continue to do exactly what God wants it to do. And so for uh, our ministry, what God has called us to do is, of course, to help this church. But what we've done since we got here last July uh, has been very busy. We've been here a little over six months, and the kids are in public school. All four of them are in the same public school, which was a blessing. And Crystal and I have taken uh, some language school classes uh, last year in 2018. And uh, we've been very active and very busy helping with the different things uh, that the church has had going on, the dinners and the outreaches and the outings and everything that churches do on a regular basis, including the services. And so we've been busy. But in the future, coming up this month, we're starting a couple of new things and we would love to have you uh, pray with us about. And uh, it's kind of a big stretch for us. You move to the mission field, you've got to be ready to stretch. But in the next month, we're going to start a student ministry uh, where we're going to invite everybody in the church and all the friends of everybody in the church from 18 uh, down to, you know, like four or five years old and have a student ministry. And so we're going to have that a couple of times a month, start out two times a month. And uh, bring the kids in and be able to sow in their lives. And it'll be a great asset to the church. And it'll be great for these kids to raise them up in the truth of God's word. Disciple them. And to have a good time with the youth and children's ministry. Um, also, in the next month, we're going to start a, a Casado's ministry. A, a married couple's ministry. Where we're going to uh, meet one time a month for kind of like a cell group type um, atmosphere, environment, if you will. We're just going to get together in fellowship. We're just going to get together and talk. We're going to discuss scripture that's very pertinent to uh, married couples, you know, because married couples deal with things that other people don't. And so we're going to be starting those two things up in the next couple of weeks, really. And so pray for us in that. It's a stretch, not because it's ministry, not because of who's involved, but honestly, it's just a stretch for us with our limited Spanish ability. And so it's going to help us grow, and we're learning more Spanish all the time, week by week, day by day. It's growing and it's growing, but just pray that those ministries will be good, that it'll be a valuable thing that people will want to uh, be a part of, and that we'll, able, we'll be able to do it with the help of the Holy Spirit, uh, be able to bring things and uh, do things that'll work good for those ministries. And so with that, what we've done over the past six months and what we're doing coming up with those prayer needs um, I want to show you some pictures, so I'm going to attach some pictures now and show you a little slideshow about what we've been doing since we've been in Granada, Spain. So after that, the video will be over. Thanks again. God bless you. We'll see you.